Diego Luna here on The Rich Eisen Show. What was that like to be injected into the Star Wars franchise for a film? What was that like for you? That, that was uh, spectacular, I have to say, because it connected me with my childhood, with myself as audience. You know, I started sure. loving cinema because of those films. No kidding. You know, yeah, 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 yeah. And I remember we had to wait longer to watch them, mm -hmm. you know, uh, th th than you guys here. So... A, they would get like two or three months later to Mexico. Sure. Uh, and it, it was it was a different time, you know, like you you, you would wait for a film months mm. and months. And yeah, I, I remember signing for the toys, you know, like yeah. uh, <laughs> in the in the in the store, in the toy store, you would be like, yeah, I want the Darth Vader and I want this and that. Right. And they would call you, uh, you know, once they got it. Uh, so it was a whole thing to be a fan, you know, right. uh, it was a, it's a, 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 a I mean, yeah, it was an everyday job, basically. I, I'm older than you, so I remember my parents taking me into New York City mm -hmm. to go to the famed Zigfield Theater to see the first Star Wars. Wow. And I remember there was a ticket holder's line for the first time in my young life. Uh -huh. <laughs> so, you know, you had to go online to buy the ticket. Yeah. And then you had to wait on the line because you were holding it to get into the theater and first come, first serve for the seating. And it was, I, I just remember I was like seven, eight years old. And uh, I'm so thrilled that my parents realized at the time what a significant movie event this was apparently going to be. Yeah. I was blown away by it. Just absolutely blown away by it. So it was kind of neat to see Rogue One, the way that they put it together as a lead up to try and set the table for the movies that I grew up watching. Yeah, it is a, it is a it homage was, to... To that genesis of Star Wars, yes. right? We shot we shot a lot like emulating how they did it back then. Uh, how you do know, you mean? What do you mean? Like we constructed everything. There's no green screens. You know, the stuff Get is out there. Of here. Yeah, you push a button and things happen in the cockpit. And like there, the things are there. The the the. No kidding. <laughs> there's an actor behind a mask and someone operating the mask, and it's all mechanical. Like we were interacting with real stuff. Now the uh, lightsabers are fake, though, right? No. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. You got to be better. Be careful. You hit the wrong button, and all of a sudden you got a, <laughs> you got an issue going on. But back then, I mean, yeah, it was like, what are you gonna do in February? And yes. you would be like, I'm gonna watch Star Wars. That's my plan. Right. Because you had to do a lot. For more of the Rich Eisen Show, tune to Audience Channel 239 on Directv for free on BR Live, or download the Rich Eisen and show app.